going on guys? Beastly Gamer here, welcome to the channel. Today's video is about Microsoft's Xbox One and some changes coming to the UI. And I know I have a lot of friends out there on the Xbox. If you're on the Xbox One, Killer Instinct Season 2 is free with Xbox One Games of Gold this month. Just went live, I just downloaded mine, so download yours. Incredible game, very fun. And if you want to challenge the beast, just let me know in the comments below. The Xbox One's UI has been the bane of the console for a long time. Now, over the last couple of years, they've definitely got better with updates and upgrades to the UI. But Microsoft still understands that the UI is not truly built for speed. I think the PlayStation 4's user interface is much more cohesive. It works really, really fast. Everything seems really easy to find. And for all intents and purposes, the Xbox One still is second best when it comes to the user interface. But this is something that they know something that they're working on and they're actually trying to make the UI dashboard even faster. I'll drop a link in the description. Microsoft is finally rebuilding the Xbox One dashboard for speed. The Xbox One dashboard was built with Connect in mind. From the overall user interface to the basic fundamentals that assign system resources accordingly. Microsoft has slowly been walking back some of those decisions with improved focus on quick access to features with the controller but there are still some inherent problems with dashboard performance. It appears that Microsoft is finally about to address the Xbox One dashboard issues. In a blog post detailing a new game mode for Windows 10, Microsoft reveals that it is not only Windows 10 that is getting some performance enhancements. Xbox's Mike Yabara explains, quote, Every Xbox One will see an update coming to the guide that will make it faster to complete common tasks. Through one press of the Xbox button on your controller, you'll be able to pull up a newly enhanced guide as an overlay on the left side of your screen, no matter what you're doing." End quote. Microsoft is also planning to rebuild popular quote, multitasking experiences end quote, with speed in mind. Your bar cites the ability to record clips, adjust their length, and access them all directly within the new guide. Microsoft will also add a new achievement tracking overlay, gamer score leaderboard, music controls, and new Cortana design. Xbox One users are well aware of some of the dashboard sluggishness, so any changes to speed things up will be welcome ones. Microsoft doesn't say when these new guide changes will be implemented, but it's reasonable some will arrive around the same time as the creator's update ships to Windows 10 PCs in April. This is great news, and this is more iteration and more changes that are minute that make the experience better. The fact that Xbox team Microsoft knows that the Xbox UI needs some help, it's, it struggles in certain places, it means that they're working to make the gaming experience better for us. And who knows, man, by the end of this console generation, the Xbox One might be neck to neck with PlayStation when it comes to overall functionality. It might even be better, depending on what Microsoft focuses on and issues that they tackle. This is great news for me. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you think that the Xbox One user face is slow? Do you think it's convoluted and confusing? How do you stack it up compared to the PlayStations? Do you think it's better? Do you think it's worse? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Be sure to give a thumbs up, show support for the channel, join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, and you can support the Beastly Gamer channel at BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.